everybody, Terry Cruz and Son of Beast here. Welcome back to another NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports. Now it's time to send you over to the Western Conference of this matchup. It's the Clippers facing against the Mavericks. As we're ready to see this one for a retake in Dallas at American Airlines Center. The next commentary I will have is Paintbrush, and he is also along with Gangsta Beast and the fur commentary to the crew, all safe for once. It's Tyler Beast. And for this moment, it will be David Aldridge here on the sideline that will be reporting for tonight's game of the matchup. James Harden is on Luka Doncic. Terrence Mann on Kyrie Irving. Paul George on Derek Jones Jr. Kawhi Leonard on PJ Washington. And Ibika Zubox on Daniel Gafford. Let's find out who wins this game. Dallas up ahead, 2 1. Will the Clippers take the tie or the Mavericks take it all? Let's get started, folks. Enjoy. Hello, everyone. It's Paintbrush, and we are coming to you live at American Airlines Center. I'm also along with my other commentaries of the crew with Tyler Beast and Gangsta Beast. David Aldridge is here on the sideline. It's a great matchup as now we are ready for game number four, the rematch since season three. And for the postseason they've been playing it since NBA 2K21 in season five. You're ready to have that one all settled in. It's go time. Let's get it done. You know, it's a great game. I always love to see that one when it comes in by, so let's hope this one turns to be good. As now for the Clippers wins the face off, we start things up, field and ready to go. George is on Jones Jr. Dawkins is on James Harden. Mika Zubox, he's with on, on Daniel Gapper. Then across the middle is Irving on man. And finally, we have it across in the middle here. It's one all goes for PJ Washington on Kawhi Leonard. Here's a start. Dawkins right toward the corner, now fighting to get to Irving. Irving, here's a three for Dawkins. Start things off in a triple range. That is an amazing three-point bucket score after assist by Irving. You know Irving has that one all done. I really love him. That one turns to be a great one to take, but it's not for long for you to take. A big steal here. Here comes Dunkic. Finishing drive. Scoops it in. Five points in the game, and it's now only 5-0 score over Los Angeles. Now a pass to Kawhi Leonard. Leonard now finds George to the outside on Jones Jr. The screen given. Here's a drive. Oh, the push off. Oh, George did not see that coming. This one just goes in. Now here's the problem with that. You know, Paul George is very aggressive right now. You, you don't take a mistake from him. But you never really got that with all you got. There's just no way. You just, you just don't want to make that one mess up and mistake it. That turns the things over, and then you're going to have a tough time to get it over. Another great bucket score for Jones Jr. A 2-1 series, looking for 3-1 in the game. Now, there's no stopping here, because there is another takeoff for Dallas Mavericks. They are already been clutching in right now, but they need some help here. Their offense has got to get moving. Dalkins with the rebound, not fighting again to get for it, with only six minutes going by in the first quarter. Looks back to Donkic, now finds again to B.J. Washington. Washington gives again to Donkic. Donkic for a try, scoops it in, he's got seven points. Nine to two is the score, as a couple games happened here in game number one. He only had scored just a couple of it, but that one didn't take it all. Now, I never see what does happen. They don't really, in fact, know the truth from anybody. They really were mixing him up. They just saying, hey, we don't want Luka Doncic to keep on shooting it all night. He's been all that good, and he's never going to let that one come down flying fast. But just to say now, I mean, it's just what you all do, but just keep that tight one in there. It's never going to be easy. What are you good for? Here's Doncic for the two. Another one takes one in. He has nine points in this game. 5 12 to go. It's 11 4 lead. Los Angeles takes a timeout with 5 10 to go. Oh, that's when you start things up here, Mavericks. We love to have that one party all night. As you're waiting for the approachment right now, as we're approaching the second game, we'll see how they can do for the next couple games. The Heat battle against the Bucks here back at the Caseya Center. 
That will be the first one happening here at 3 p.m. Following along with the second game, as we have the third one for the Wolves, facing against the Suns at Footprint Center. That will be at 5.30 p.m. with the next part of the game in coverage. Then following along with the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs, you'll see them underway. As we have the first part of the game, it's the Leafs facing against the other team, the Panthers, back at the Everett Arena. And then following along with the next game, the Golden Knights are taking on against the Edmonton Oilers, back at Rogers Place at 9.30 p.m. That'll be all games here, only on Son of Beast. New lines, boot substitution is right now, they're all stretched in. And here's a takeoff right now for Zubox. He finds a pass to PG-13. Here's a Harden on the contact foul. Starts off for the Mavericks. Luka Doncic with his first personal foul and a first team foul for the Mavericks. Now look at the drive here. You see what James Harden is doing. He's making it in there just as time goes by. It's not really easy when you try to like mess things up already, but you can't let that happen all the way. First free throw coming up here as we will have the Mavericks with the first penalty on the foul as the first one will put in for Los Angeles. James Harden hits the first free throw. His last game appearance, he played with the Philadelphia 76ers and they made their team to the second round, but it all happens to be the end for James Harden's new era with the Philadelphia Sixers. And the same thing on the other side has to go with Patrick Beverly. His team didn't help at all. But this won't be the day to have it all him coming down. Yeah, I know. It's a little disappointment already. But hey, who wants to know that Harden wants to bring him to the Clippers? You know I don't. Well, it's just not what they always want to. Let's bring it in here and just at all time just the score does. I mean, let them handle it if they can get there that far. Irving twists the pass. He now finds Gatford. Ball stolen by Zubox. James Harden now finds PG-13. Jones Jr. on the cover. Slides back. Bouncing over at the free throw line. It's a no good for the two. Another take here. And now he finds Donkic. Donkic gives a swing. And here's a three for Jones Jr. Rolls in and out. Rebound and puts it by Ika Zubox. Now has to be our way in the middle. This one just goes up and it just made a great solid defensive effort for the Mavericks. Dunk it on a throw down. Oh, what did he take it in? That's how you suck things up here for Dunkett's drive. Hero step in right now. You get this one. Good creation. What a takeover. That's how you start the appearance out there, Dunkett. Leonard on Washington. The screen puts in for Harden. Luka watching it. Solid take as Luka Doncic has his second rebound of the night. Mavericks up ahead seven. Now has it again to Washington. Rolls it in. Now finds a pass back to Irving. Irving takes the over to Washington. Here's the three for Jones Jr. Can't get it to go. Now back again to Jones Jr. Try to look over again. Shot clock down to six. Irving, will he take two? Yes, up, and it's no good. He's going to have a hard time now. I mean, Curry Irving is not really well enough in game four, but I don't think he wasn't ready to have that one settled in. And that one sent it in for Kawhi Leonard, as he has his first bucket in with 3 10 to go. Timeout for to be the first call for Dallas Mavericks. Now you see what happens now. Every postseason, they are really been stepping in, in between. But when you look over it again, you can find out what they've done here for the last part of the post game of the season. And I know they won't happy enough at that point. But what do you think here? Well, it's just what they do. Dallas Mavericks are really like a better start routine. All the effort is not really turning to be the same thing. I know it's a hard one, but hey, let's guess this. If the Dallas Mavericks have a great winning opportunity, they can definitely have that one back. May not be what they are calling for, but let's have the face-off in. I would love to see what they could do. Now that one step up in between.
some new changes for the Mavericks and for the Clippers. Exum checked in with Hardy. And all five players here for the Clippers are checked out as all five players checked in. Coffee, BJ Tucker, Powell, Plumley, and Westbrook are checked in. And the other side, we have Sam Hardaway Jr. He's with Lively the second. Maxi Kleba is in right to the point four position. Hardy now finding Exum for the triple. Oh, New York starts off here for Exum. He has his first three pointer. And it's Hardy with the assist. Make that clear now because Exxon has got a really good open look. A excellent three-pointer started off big. Westbrook mixes off with a drive and a layup and he will have his first bucket. Dallas up by six. He now finds Hardy. Hardaway and it reads over. Here comes Westbrook. Finishes off with a slam dunk with two bands. It's just not the good way to start with the foul guys in that after that steal puts it in there, I know Norman Powell has been doing it over, but they can't let that one get over it right in between. They, they don't want that one to leave it out of the zone. This hard one, it's not going to be easy. Here's a pass back to Hardaway Jr. He now finds Kleba. Kleba on a sudden bound. Right up is in. Maxi Kleba with his first bucket of under two minutes. It's just going in. Now you can definitely feel like Maxi Kleba is on the roll. P.J. Tucker with the screen. Good help here for Coffee as he puts another one and a foul's called on Maxi Kleba. That's his first personal and her second team foul calls for Dallas Mavericks. Now that's a hard one. P.J. Tucker was really trying to answer that one here. They call it foul, but this has happened. He just went from fingertip and that is not going to stand still. Second free throw coming up here for the L.A. Clippers is now it's no P.J. Tucker starting things up here. With under two minutes. He hits the first free throw. And PJ Tucker's not really the only guy you wanted to be on. But it's all what you take here after the Sixers. He's now transferred off and with the replacement for Nicholas Batu. Yeah, it's just a hard one that everybody's been doing it. I know P.J. Tucker's been doing it, but hey, their contacts are getting everywhere for here for P.J. Tucker. If he gets more done, then he's going to have to, like, try to fix something up. They want to make a pick him and make a win. That's a hard part. Let it go with the flow. Now he finds the pass to Lively the second. The three for Kleba. Good in the virtual range. That's his five points in the game, and it's now 21-14. Norman Powell on, Hardaway Jr. now finding Tucker for three. The answer back is no good. Lively the second's got his first rebound, now has it again to Hardy. Hardy now will swing it over to Maxi Kleba. Maxi Kleba trying to look it over with some new changes. The bounce pass stolen by Coffee. Coffee gets to Westbrook for two. That misses again for the LA Clippers. Back to Exxon. Exxon will now find again a Hardy. Now he will give it over to Lively the second. Looks it again, now finds Exxon. Off to Hardaway Jr. For the range. They'll get it back. Exxon up and good. Exxon with this Hardy, sorry. He has his first rebound and the first bucket in. You know, it's just not what they say. Josh Hardy is just really getting it over with a better timing. But this effort won't take it all. If he does have more room, the responses is going to get take it clear around the word, and it won't be enough to take in for Hardy on this time. Mavericks up again, 23 to 16. Now finds it again at Hardaway Jr. Jr. now finds it again at Lively the second. Swinging down, six to go. Three for Hardy. Nowhere to go, and number miss puts up by Dallas. Powell over to Westbrook for two. The layup puts in now as assist puts up by Cop by Norman Powell. And half court will not be enough. That ends the first quarter, 23 to 18. Looks like there's going to be a close game in between, but we'll find out soon enough. Just don't let it sit there. Keep on coming. Keep attacking. We gotta work hard. We come to the end of the line, we'll be right back with you with the second quarter. You're watching the NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports. And 
you just tuning in, we welcome you back in American Airlines Center as we start the second quarter. To talk about this, this was nowhere in there. They were really just trying to show up how their pride is. But what is a good TV technician, you guys? They're really just starting to make that one showing off. They really are pushing their way in. But they did not really do really well at all. The better of the offense may not be the better technician. But keep an eye on it for Luka Doncic. He might be doing some hero stepping leads if he gets it. Luka Doncic is on James Harden and filled up by Gatorade. Irving, he's on Norman Powell. Washington is on Kawhi Leonard. Powell on Daniel Feist. And finally, it's George on Green. Green, Irving. Go for two. This time, he gets the two pointer. Three pointer. Here's PG-13. Paul George trying to roll it over. Another screen. Fading a shot. Looks for Feist. Powell up. And that will take it in here for Daniel Feist. He has his first bucket. And Paul George with the assist. They're down by six. They're racing it. They're battling it out right now. They don't want to leave that one open. They can't let that one just start stopping them. Irving will try to give it back to Powell. And he will now swing it over again to B.J. Washington. He now has it to Irving. Another three. Triple arch in a range. He has six points. And it's a 29 to 20. Irving trying to look some motion in there. And Irving, oh, Leonard just got that one slammed down. No way to make that one. Man down. Don't tell him now. He finds Washington. He's over in the corner now, finding again to Irving. Irving gets again to Donkic. The bounce pass gives it back to Irving. Warner makes some new changes here. Gets the dog and he's up. Layup, and he's fouled. Table fights with his first personal. And our team foul puts in for LA. After the put up here for Irving, he's trying to get that one here with a layup. Go in. Yeah, it's a great contact in the foul. They got a good one. Never field trip to the free throw line. We'll be the Dallas Mavericks as Luka Doncic at the free throw line. Shooting two. He has 11 points this game. Looking to get 13. Dockage next to Prefa. On with some new substitutions. As now Terrence Mann, he's checked in for Norman Powell. And the Mavericks also trying to make some new huffling changes here to switch some sides in as Green will try to make some new changes here on your offense. Good for two as Donkic got 13 points. Highland with the ball, 31-22 to score. Highland. Pull the pressure in for Donkic. Now finds a pass to Kawhi Leonard. Over Washington. Fadeaway shot, no good. Washington's got his third rebound. Now finds again to Luka Donkic. Pulls it over to Washington. Now finds again to Irving. Irving gives it back. Now finds Donkic. Donkic with a layup. Tightness on the roll as lively power will have it. Green. Gives it off. Now finds Washington. Give off to Irving. Five to shoot. Over Harden. And good. Irving's got eight points. 33-22. They are up by 11. No question to go with it because Irving just goes Uncle Drew moment. Timeout call by LA Clippers with 535 left to go. Hey, just got to say to warn you now, Irving, what do you got? You picked that one good up with the show off over Harden. He said, felt like, who, who is he now? He's awesome. New line group substitutional for the Mavericks and for the Clippers. As right now, a couple of the players, only one is checked out. Spice is checked out, and now Zubox checked back in. On for that one here as we're looking for Terrence Mann to get the bucket, and this one is no good. Well, there's a lot of big upsets going on in between, and I'm going to tell you now, it looks like that the Mavericks already have been trying to like, they want to upset their other team. I need fourth seed. I mean, this is like a close game. 
Five figures are going to be like the biggest year this year of the upset because no Giannis on the Kupo and no Damian Lillard because they were already been losing a streak. Yeah, I definitely have a lot of great feelings in between, but uh, I just got a lot of a great thing to say is it might be showing up what they can do. Reporter for David Aldrich. He's talking to one of us right now for Tyrone Lou. He's been our head coach here for the LA Clippers for most of the time, but his ultimate years, he really wants to show how he gets it done. It's just not what you do. You don't try to take a lot of timing. Your offensive ability is not taking all of it for Tyrone Lou. He's been trying to hold up his team already, but let's keep it going if we get there. Go Atlanta finishes off with a drive, and it's a 35 26 game. If under 4 30 to go. It's Donkic, he will now find it again to P.J. Washington. He gives it an over, now back to Donkic. Donkic swings back to Irving. Irving trying to pull it up with the bounce pass, and Green back the other way, now finding it over again to Washington. Up and over head pass, over Powell, and good! Over Zubax has got it in there. First bucket of the night for D. White Powell. Now you just have to do now, just get it going. Kawhi Leonard, the two-pointer misses again. P.J. Washington with his fourth rebound, now having it again to Powell. Here comes Dunkic, off the drive, and good! Dunkic with 15 points, with three free to go, and it's Powell with the assist. You know how this has happened, because I know that D.Y. Powell has been really like going in there, but he's going great. And James Harden with another two, with 30, 30 to go. Now he's going to take for Doncic. This time he gets it to Green. Green settling around a little bit, now finds Washington. He now finds it over. Green back to Irving. On a two, better range than that. Irving's got 12 points. Nary now with a 15 point near mark with, Car with Luka Doncic. And now George with the ball on Green. Final three minutes in the first half of the game. As he goes up and makes a layup in. PG-13, trying to deliver it up on the road here. He has only a 22 and only one of his shooting percentage. It's just no way to make the cut. Ever easy enough, just do what he does. He has it over to D.Y. Powell, now has it again to Green. Now has it again to Washington. Goes to the baseline, and good. P.J. Washington with his first bucket. 43 30 to score, but under 2 30 to go. It just rolls it out. Just gotta believe in what you've been seeing. Green against George. Pulls it back with the jumper. And a miss, and there is a foul called on James Harden on the Clippers. And that would be a loose ball covered up here at the Los Angeles Clippers. Now a new substitution. Terrence Vance checked in for James Harden. Having it off, Mavericks, back on the court, all goes down. We just saw, saw coming Derek Jones Jr. And Daniel Gapro checks him in for D. White Powell. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Washington in the corner now, finding it over again to Jones Jr. Jr. stepping back, rolls in and out. Nervous picks in for, Gap, for Jones Jr. And now here comes Sideman. Gafford! What a take here! Now that's what the first rejection does. If Gafford had that one coming, he had a rejection right in time. That's going to be like a hard one to go in. Irving on the outside, trying to look at some more room. He gets to get it done. Gets. And Washington with the ball. For a try. Oh, what a take! Washington with his second bucket. And now Terrence Mann. Gives again to ZB goes to box. Slides back. Now finds Man. Man. Up for three. It's good. And the outside puts it up. It's a 45-33 day. They are down by 12. Just don't let them happen right now. They won't get that one in the way. You just don't want to leave a message again. They can't leave that one behind already. Donkic on the outside, down to six. Looks at down bounce pass to Washington. Irving for a two. It's good. Irving with 14 points. With under 40 seconds in the game. 
47-33, they are trailing by 14. Highland up, the drive puts it up too soon, and it goes back the other way as Gafford's got one. Let the clock wind down in the first half, and this one's almost going to be the end of it to finish it all. Yeah, it's just no way. No luck at all for the Clippers, they just don't have the time to do it. Donkey Chow finds it down to Gafford, up and a two, it's it in. Gafford's got his first bucket with eight seconds. Last possession for the first half, door to two, and that rolls it in, and that will end the first half. 49-35 is the score, and Irving will finish it here. Great scoring battle for the Dallas Mavericks and the LA Clippers. We are halfway approached down, nearing the second half. But first, David Aldridge on the sideline on a report. Hey, Dave. Sends you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks a lot. Kyrie, what was your plan for tonight? I was trying to get assistance in the beginning. I'm just having a good time out here. Got it going a little bit. Enjoy myself. Okay, Kyrie, we'll see you in the second half. Thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. We have come down to the end of the first half. We'll get you back to the second half after this. First quarter is next after this. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is right here. Say hey to the folks, Kenny. Hey, folks. Say hey to the yeah, folks, Shaq. Hey, folks. Hey, let's get this party started. Luka Doncic has been the story in this one. He ended up with 15 points, 4 rebounds, and 4 assists. And Kenny, what are your thoughts on how Dallas played? Well, they went downtown and threw a party. And fortunately, we were all invited. The key is their shooters weren't afraid to pull the trigger on open looks. It's a blowout right here. Shaq, what was your takeaway on the Clippers? They need to give more energy and effort on the board. New balance up has been one of the main issues. Probably is they're getting bullied. I'm not sure if they have the players to change that. And that's a wrap for our halftime show. The third quarter just about to get started. You've been watching a 2K Sports Halftime Show. And we wish we were bringing our way approach. We welcome you back at Dallas for a start for the third quarter in the NBA playoffs. What a professional start for Luka Doncic. He's making his way down on his EuroLeague step up. 15 points with four rebound and one block. How do you believe this guy? Well, he's just really all into pursuit. He breaks out with a great transition. I must say, Luka Doncic, he's a fire to take over on his top best performance effort of the NBA. Start things up here for the second half. It's now Washington, he's on Kawhi Leonard. Doncic, he's with on James Harden. Irving, he's on Tyreek's fan. Gafford, he's on Ivica Zubox. And finally, we have his Jones Jr. on Paul George. Step back for the two. Irving will get it back. And he will take the layup in. Irving's got 16 points with his second rebound. It's just know how hard feeling it is. I mean, you just got to make sure you have it all in it. And here's George driving right to the front. And what a basket made. Paul George trying to get back into work. 10 points in the game. Points in paint is 8. 51-37 to score. Now back to Irving. Irving. Off to Gapper, fading over the shot. That's missed. Donkic with the rebound and finds again to Irving. Irving trying to look for some more motion offense. Overhead pass. Finding Luca in the corner. Good. Gapper with the assist. He has 17 points. Look at the crowd feeling. You really love Luka Donkic. You have to believe it. All right, another throw down already. This one is going back the other way. Terrence Mann with the assist. Oh, boy. We're really walking it out right now already. I mean, back to back with the throw downs? I mean, sorry. No question can't do. Well, it's just no way. I mean, they don't have a lot of time feeling already, but they really are not going to get that one off to a hard pressure. Attacker's going to be a lot harder to challenge. Washington Jones Jr. Rugby scores it in. Finally has his bucket in. He has a second one for tonight. A little bit cold here, but trying to get back into work. 
And man is on Irving. Solid performance. Up! Oh, what a solid, terrific performance from Kyrie Irving. And this Maverick's never going to slow down. Irving finishes off with a drive. 18 points, 57 39. They really are making that one feel good. Look how you can do. You're making good? Off to a Fennec on a roll. And Donkic will give off to Washington. He now has it to gap for it. Up oh, and good. Thanks for the assist, Washington. And it's Gafford with the second bucket. Timeout call by LA Clippers. 5.24 left to go. They're up ahead by 20. Let's it go. Make it feel good. And they are on with the moment. I really think they really are stepping it up the pace right now. Let's give them a go and give them a welcome. The NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by Starry Lines. State Farm. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. And by Adidas. If you subscribed already, we have another content that we have it for you here as we have a special sneak peek review as we are getting ready to have this one for another event. And that's right. He's about to do some overall review here of the BFDI and NBA Sandy Tour. So you don't want to miss that one out here once he's finished with this event. And he'll be ready to take these on on the other side. Speaking of which, we've also spotted on, we have a new episode coming into range. The BFDI TBNT and with a new episode, a returning of the BFDI A for the back half of the three only for the range in between Los Angeles, Chicago, Illinois, and Fort Lauderdale, Florida. With the first three on the other side, we have is New York, Seattle, and Houston will be the first three for a new episode of the BFDI TBOT, and season two is back. We love to have that one in here, but I'll be I'll be attending it already on the other side, so I don't want to miss that one out. It's going to be great. Have fun with that one, I'm going to back to Los Angeles. Okay. Get that one a good for our credit. We have a report for David Aldridge this time. It's now what happens here for Kyrie Irving. He's been a better one to play after contract. After we're playing with the Boston, with the Brooklyn Nets, he now has his new take if he wants to have it all. A lot of new contracts in between of D'Angelo Russell, but this is nowhere left to be in the range by that. Yeah, it's just like a hard one to take over. That's why Kyrie Irving is really a all into pursuit. He's really wanting to get to his work attentional scoring. It's nowhere offensively. They really are showing a lot of respect in between, but they can't let that one be stopped. It's how hard it is. It's not been gonna be out there. It makes the first free throw for Exo. You know, the hard part about here for Dukari Irving is we call him nicknamed this Uncle True moment. And this is what nobody has really has spelled it on. They really are making a lot of hard work and credit, and this offense won't let that happen. You know, I can definitely say now, it's just what if they all do, make that one feel good, but let Exum do the hard work. Second free throw is good for Exum. Five points of the game, it's a 61-39 game, and Russell Westbrook with the ball. Longer Donkic on there, avoiding the screen without the offensive foul. Russell Westbrook, denied by Gafford. Here's Irving, finishing off with a light touch layup and he makes it in. Irving's got 20 points on the full breakout chain after a defending tumbled over for the Los Angeles Clippers. And now, they're gonna make some timeouts again. Yeah, this is what nobody is liking. They don't let that one believe on. <laughs> As we spot it in time right now, as we, if you're looking to have that one in with you, we hope you'll be there. Because if you attended the tickets, good luck. We will hope you have a fun trip. And in between, the close to your home, will be the new ones to take. But there might be expansion playing here for the NMA Sandy and the FDI tour. There probably could be another way to get this one over it. 
but we'll have it on the other side to cover you up here for a moment to have it in here for our new part of the net. You'll love it and you'll see what goes in it. Just think about now because there's a new expansion plan, maybe a new location will add things up and it's going to be a wild night. Yeah, everybody's loving it so far. I mean, especially to the NBA. And speaking of which, Spurs and Pacers are adding it in for the Paris Games in 2025. They're adding their way to a next trip. Last one was turning to be to Mexico City, but it's now turning to be our next part of the game in France. I love that paradise of France. I mean, they're really going to show things off. NBA courtesy, they're going to love the moment out there. Let's make it feel good. Now with some new substitutions on the court, as Spice has checked in, Kleba is also on the court here too. And across from here is Mason Plumley. And then we have his number one take in is Exxon. Russell Westbrook with another two pointer. It's a 63 41 game, and now Irving's got it. Nearing down the end of the third quarter, here's Irving. Donkic upward to three. This one gets it back to Gafford. Hey, it's a hard timing when you do the three-pointer, but just don't take the risk out of it, big kid, if you could do it. Irving now finding it over, bounce past the gapper. Shoots over Plumley. That's good. Leia puts it in, and it's the S6 points. Irving with the assist, 65-41 to score. James Harden on Irving. Watching that spin move, looking in, three for Westbrook. And they have it back. Another miss by Los Angeles. And now it's a take. Luca up. Oh, oh! Don't take away from me! Luca Dokic! Are you kidding me? That is 19 points. Oh uh, no Cerrito. He's ready to tell you to say back off. It's my room. I want to have some a little bit more driving, but you're trying to take over for the slam dunk. And here he comes. Yeah, there he is. He's doing it again. That's what no one does it for some reason. He's almost going to say, that's a dirty call. I uh, just don't believe that. I have nothing to prepare for it. Don't let it be out there. You know what I'm talking? Oh, no way. <laughs> I want to check in here for Gafford. That's three blocks in a row. News changes on the court. As now the Mavericks will change it off lively and Hardaway Jr. checking in. Coffee checked in for James Harden, and now Donkic Irving will be checking out as now Irving moves over to point guard. Powell for three. Another miss by Los Angeles. Now Lively will have it again to Kyrie Irving. Irving tries to give over again to Daniel Gaffer. He's off to Marley Jr. Now he has it over it again, now finding Irving. Off to score to try, flip in! He's in reverse now with 22 points. Yeah, do you know what the score in the year turns to be? Paul George didn't really think he was going to worry about that. He just only had 20, 10 points, but with 22 points, that turns it over. You're never going to let that one happen. And Mason Plumley will have a slam dunk and that one with a get back. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. Irving against Russell Westbrook. Trying to add some motion here. Tries to get off to Gafford. No stealing ball here. And this will get back again to Exo. Exo. Back pass. Plumley up. And it's rejected by Plumley. Russell Westbrook back again to Powell. Powell gives again to Westbrook. Westbrook, step back for two. Powell will get it back. Denied by Gaffer. Three for fights. That misses again. Oh boy, they're absolutely getting cold already. They're not having a good day. Yeah, this is what the problem is. That Dana Feist is really trying to get the threes in there. It's not really trying to be great, but it's just what you don't try to do. Don't let that one get in the way from it. Irving as Hardaway Jr. now has it over again to Exxon. Time winding down for two. And he will take it in there. Exxon with seven points. Extend now by 30. Fans growing silent now as Pumley is on lively the second. 
He's up now, and he's fouled. Hardaway Jr. with his first personal, and a first team foul called on Dallas. Mason Conley will head to the free throw line shooting two with just under a minute to go. missed the first free throw. Now we see new changes off here for the LA Clippers. It's now Paul George has checked back in for Coffee and Feist. It's Tucker and Mann with Paul George have checked in. Mavericks are making new changes as Irving's checked out and Gapper's checked out as Hardy and P.J. Washington check in. Probably makes a second. Now here's Hardy with 45 seconds left to go in the third quarter. Off again to Washington. Washington tries to roll it again. Now finally get to Exxon. Oh, no travel step here. It's Hardy will have it over. Three seconds left. It's stolen by Plumley. Highland looking for a fast break. Lead the yard. That misses again. 20 seconds left. Hardy with the second rebound. You're not scoring well in the field. I mean, that's a big problem. They really are never going to show it off the response. Off again to Lively the second. Now has it back again to Washington. Five seconds to go. Already up for three. And rolls in and out. That ends the third quarter at 73-44. They're already been smoking already. Down up by 28. Hopefully, this one will be the 3-1 lead. For Dallas Mavericks. Let it be. Fly up. Let's show response. Mavericks up again. Four quarters next after the break. Let's have a moment now to reveal your state pharmacist of the game. Just really have to be one. You have to go with the footwork. There's one ways that they can just try to answer it. Give off to Jones Jr. Finish the drive, get it going. Yeah, he's been fantastic now. Look at Donkeys, he's on fire tonight. A your lead step ever. Hope everyone's having fun with us, and now we are at the end of the quarter in regulation as we start things off. Terrence Mann is on Josh Green. Then across the here is Highland. He's also with Josh Hardy. Brown is with on um, Taxi Kleba. Then from center, we have Z-White Powell on PJ Tucker. And lastly, PG-13, he's with on the other side of it as he has it over. And uh, Bucket made here for PJ Tucker. And finally, Jones Jr. Here's Hardy, he now finds it again to Powell. He's ready to take his heart. Oh, what a take in. T.Y. Powell with his second bucket, they're on fire. Leave it up to be here, D.Y. Powell just roll down the clock. Screen on Highland. Trying to roll in the middle, and he went out of bounds. New change off here for the Mavericks and the Clippers as four players have checked out, four players checked in. Tucker, Brown, Coffee's checked in. And here's Hardy. Take the pass. Oh, Powell! Oh, he almost made that one in there, but it's Feist with a solid effort performance in the defender. Okay, let's very gear this out. I thought that, that Hardy was getting a deep pass over again to Powell. I said, go for A. He took it over. Oh, boy. I think, PY, I think D.Y. Powell had that rejection. Or it must have been Jones Jr. I don't know what it is now, but... That's a close one. And Plum Feist will have it in there now with uh, 640 to go. 7548 to score. He now has it again to Maxi Kleba. Kleba gets off to Green. Green tries to roll again to Jones Jr. Jones Jr. switches over now to Maxi Kleba and now finds Green. For a sidestep, that misses again and PJ Tucker with the rebound. Here's Brown. Brown feeling out a little bit. 
P.J. Tucker trying to roll for the screen. Pull it back. Two-pointer misses. Off outside is Coffee. Getting a chance now. Tucker for three. And an miss by Los Angeles. They're shooting it too much now. I mean, they are just going to have to leave it off now and just say, they are doing too much. Got to do two points instead. Hardy off the Powell. And he's over. And Coffee with the steal. Brown now finds Coffee. Coffee now finding over. And a layup will put in. After Seal, he put it in here. There's only a lot of turnovers here for Dallas, but only two for Clippers. Yeah, be careful now. If you if you're gonna like try to like pass it off, be cautious when you're gonna try to go for it. The open offense is not gonna let that happen. You're gonna get there. Jones Jr. and here's Green. He will take it in. Green's got his first bucket, and he finally has it on board. 77 to 50 to score, and now Highland is back again to Hardy. Nealand now find Puffy. Solid screen effort, and now with the drive, Hard B, Coffee up. Try to put it back. The three will put it in. Two times with the rebound, and now as it is, 77 to 52. Four three left to go in the fourth quarter. He now has it over to Jones Jr. Jones Jr. gets off to Green. Green finishing the drive. Oh, what a take! Green with his second bucket. You know, you're having a hard time with that. He's doing the same move just like Kyrie Irving does. Neyland for two. And we'll have it in there, and this will be another bucket for her. Highlands, two point. And already will have the ball. Now finds again a power. Powell gives again to Jones Jr. Jr. gives it over now to Finding Hardy. Hardy tries to swing over to Kleba. Kleba trying to roll it in now again to Jones Jr. For the two. And good. Range it in there is six points in the game. 345 left to go in the fourth quarter. 81 54. Coffee. Screen up ice. Coffee trying to roll it in and out. Tucker with the ball. Back to Brown. All the way to the screen. Lay up in. Got it back. And an wrist puts that break with Clippers. Maxi Klebo showing it up as he has a second rebound. Back outside is Hardy. Now is it over to get into Jones Jr. Jones Jr. swings it over back to Klebo. Hardy. Try to roll up for the two. And good. Hardy has his fourth points of the game in a second bucket. And Maxi Kleba with the assist. Just going to keep on coming down now. Maxi Kleba's getting it really good. Pile it up. The layup drive will put it in here. That's another two point bucket scores in. Now back again to Hardy. Hardy swings over to Green. Green slides back down, finds Joe Jr. Jones Jr. now pulls it over to Hardy. Hardy finds Kleba. Kleba gives again to Hardy. Back outside of Green. Five to shoot. Jones Jr. slides up for the two. Another miss by Dallas. And Brown will have it here. Find a pass to Highland. Oh, Kleba denied that shot. Show me what you got now. That has been an all impressive now. Maxi Kleba, he's rolling it again. And he has six points. What a lucky guy. I'm just saying now, Maxi Kleba is just really blocking everywhere. I mean, how can you do that? That drive will scoop it in for Highland. It's now a 85 58 game. Lots of stats for Dallas. Only had seven blocks and only 14 fast break points in the game in game four. Now Hardy will have it again to Jones Jr. Rolls down to Kleba. Kleba giving a sign off to Hardy. Oh, Hardy won that one. And Green up again. Back to Hardy for two. That rolls in and out. Daniel Feist back again to Highland. 90 seconds remaining in the fourth quarter. And Coffee sunk down. Now the timer will be called by Dallas Mavericks. It's his 85-60 game. 
Table talking's over one last time before the end of the regulation. The NBA playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by Sour Patch Kids. Sour Sweet Gone. Your local Kia dealers. A moment that expires. And by AT&T 5G. Fast, reliable, and secure as connecting changes everything. Luka Doncic. Doncic is really like a professional player. From Euro League all the way to the American team of the NBA, he's been like a power. And he's ready to take on in the Paris Olympics in 2024. After the season is finished, they're ready to get back into work. The rare time. Yeah, better time has always been coming in there. They're ready to have more. Luka Doncic trying to settle it in there and bring their team to the next round if they win this game in game five. We're nearing down to the last five minute marker as now here's Lee White Powell. He finds again the green. Outside, here's a three for Exum, and he will take it in. He has 10 points. 88 60 to score, they are loving it. Yeah, everybody's standing up right now. Hey, Peter O'Leary is the team. Fights against Cleveland. Over with the shot. Solid D. Trying to pull it back in. Back to Plumley. Coffee on the outside with under a minute. Pull it back. And he's fine. D. Wright Powell with his first personal and his first team foul calls on Dallas. Mason Plumley will get to the free throw line shooting two. And here's a static he's been pulling in there. He played for Duke University, but it was never a year long until again he had that one with a huge comeback victory scores. And with this national championship team and playing with his older brother, Miles Plumley. Yeah, this is what they do now. Both brothers have been playing right now, but I think Miles Plumley, he must have got that one with old better record of this time. And I say he's definitely been playing it since 2010, and now with the Indiana Pacers. But this one winning with an NBL championship with the Perth Wildcats now. I think his better, better offense, he's been going in. And now, his better shooting technique is now with a different team. After Plumlee's two free throws of the game, Hardy will close things off with 45 seconds. I think he wants that time. Will he do it? Oh no, he did not make it in there. Highland with the ball now finding coffee. Kleba trying to roll on to him. And that one will be a hard defense to take. And Cleveland will now find him hard. He's on the other side of the court. Team is applying for them. As they're making their way with a game four winner and heading back to forcing the game five back in Los Angeles. It will be in every night before a win or go home for Los Angeles Clippers. Yes, they do. I know they're having a lot of hard time now, but let me make, make a flow. Let them live. But the better technique is never worth it. They really have it all coming in here to finish the night, and it's all over. Well done to the Mavericks. And that's going to wrap it up here. 88 to 62 is your final score. Long place out there, and there really are being effort now. Now it's a 3 1 series. Hope to get back into more. And that's what they do. Celebrate night. What a victory. And now a chance now to go send you over to the court side to David Aldridge for a player of the game. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Kyrie. It looked like you were in an extra crispy special kind of zone tonight. How did you do it? Uh, man, well, the beauty is in the process. It's in the preparation. You know, I, before I get here, I'm trying to get locked in mentally. Um, just trying to come out here and put on a good performance.
performance and lead my team and give the best job I can. That's all I'm trying to do. It was all on display tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. And that's going to wrap it up, folks. Look, me, Paintbrush, along with Gates, the Beast, and Tyler, this has been a presentation of the NBA playoffs. What a wild night this is, and we'll have more games underway coming on your side of the court. See you next time for another NBA. Have a great night in Dallas. All right, thank you so much, Paintbrush, and now it's time for your total statistics in between. 67% and 50% for field goals and three-pointers for Dallas Mavericks. And 88 free throw percentage for the Los Angeles Clippers. They've already been pushing their way out. 14 fast, fast break points for Dallas Mavericks. 46 points in paint with 12 and 35 for Los Angeles Clippers. 36 assists here for Dallas Mavericks. Then 18 offensive rebounds for the Los Angeles Clippers. 26 defensive rebounds for Dallas Mavericks. Five steals for the Clippers and seven blocks with Dallas Mavericks back to back in between. Two turnovers, two team fouls, and seven dunks was remain for Los Angeles Clippers. Van 30 biggest lead in time possession was 18-15 for Dallas Mavericks. All stay to go for. I mean, they're really on to a full pressure in the heat. Why do they make it go? It's just a hard one that nobody was ever going to get through. Make them feel good. Make them feel proud. I mean. You're all for it, a lifetime of your life. And now it's time for your three star players of the game. I start over you, Terry Cruz. All right, thank you so much. Third star starts it off here, and they're all in for everybody. I'm thinking that everybody did a great job, but I'm going to start with Dante Exum with 10 points and one rebound, two assists, three out of five field goals, two three pointers, and three three pointers with 14 performance effort. He just makes it good. Excellent work. Second star goes to Luka Doncic, your New Balance player of the game, with 21 points, 5 rebounds, with a block and a steal, and 5 assists. 9 and 11 field goal range, 1 3 pointer and 2 3 pointers. He only had 31 performance effort, and he made his finishing throwdown with one dunk. I say interleague best ever. What do you know? He's all in for everything. Keep on going, keep on attacking. And your number one star of the game. Well, say hello to this. It all stands for Uncle Drew. Kyrie Irving finishes with 22 points, 4 assists, and 4 rebounds, 10 out of 11 field goals, 2 3 pointers, and 2 3 pointers on the other side of the first and second half. Then, 31 performance effort was his total time on the court. Well done for the Uncle Drew movement, and he has been a liftoff way to finish the night in game 4. Yeah, that's right, Terry. I mean, they're really doing really well. I mean, keep that one eye on the pride if you can. That's true. Always got to show them off. Mavericks, just show them off the closeout gap. We come to the end of it here with the first two games, but we'll see you on the other side right now as we'll be ready for our next pregame show for Game 5 of the NHL on Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. If you're tuning us here, we'll see you back to the other side of the NHL. And thank you all for your patience here. We're ready for game five with you. Let's go. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. This is Summit Beast and Terry Cruz wishing you a good night. Have a great evening, everyone. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.